today we're out here doing the chainsaw training course. Uh, well, obviously it's a chance to be out again in a different setting with uh, with the people that we know very well and work with, but without dirt bike helmets on. And uh, and as well, you know, you're always something to learn here. I mean, even though we've been doing this for a long time, I mean, taking these courses, this is my second time, but we are we are always learning. So. Uh, well, this particular course is uh, One Day Awareness, is what we call it. Um, the association, which is the CTF, we offer one day, two day, three day, and four day courses. Um, the big thing is just how to handle the saw appropriately. Make sure we got good grip, good stance. Don't get ourselves in line with the cutting uh, chain and, and bar so that uh, if there are potentials of kickback of any kind, you're less likely to get, uh, get hurt or injured. If they can take away one, two items where they can actually focus on that, can get better. And then it's a success. Training like this is important because we are focused on the safety of our volunteers. You know, we are, we're obliged to follow the rules of occupational health and safety and workers' compensation, and uh, it's very important as a club that we're responsible in order to get our access to the land. I mean, this is just another example of a great volunteer opportunity so that, you know, when we can go out into the woods, we have the tools we need in order to be safe and get the job done. I believe it's important for us uh, as volunteers to get out and make sure trails are sustainable, make sure they're not getting overridden, destroyed. I'm Steve, I'm one of the maintenance directors on the RMDRA. Um, we're basically out here today building some mats, some bridges. The mats are basically to keep the bikes out of water, out of uh, wetlands, just to keep them up, keep the mud off. I've been doing this for probably, I think, two years now, and it's I just get so much enjoyment out of doing it and a sense of accomplishment when you're riding over it. It's, you know what, I, I took the time and did that, made the trail better. It gives the members basically something to give back to, to basically make sure future generations still have something to ride on. If you are thinking about joining up or just want something to do, reach out. There's always volunteer positions open for basically everything we do. You get a sense of accomplishment that you helped out and just feel good.